welcome back. It's a me. We're doing Scorpion's chapter. Let's go. Once Outworld rules Earthrealm, you will be free to remake the Lin Kuei in any manner you see fit. Bihan, don't listen. We must stop them. Not Silence, Kuei Liang. But brother, obey your grandmaster. Can you win this war? Soul stealers are deadly, but they're not enough. You only think so because you don't understand their true purpose. Explain. Emperor Ying built this fortress during one of Earthrealm's most turbulent periods. Enemies beset him on all sides. He built a great army to protect his empire. He built a second one to protect him in the afterlife. This is like Onaga's army, bro. This, this, this is, is just Yen's deadly alliance. I wonder if Onaga is going to appear in the next but game. Does this history lesson have a point? These statues were constructed and enchanted by the great mages in the Emperor's court. by fragments of souls. Once alive, they fight tirelessly, unburdened by remorse or pity. I seem very mobile. As our ally, you will be given command of several battalions. Few in Earthrealm could then resist the Lin Kuei. Behind. Oh, Kuei, you gotta turn on your brother. He's just a joy. Father would turn in his grave if he saw this. He was a doddering old fool. He did us a favor having that accident. And I was right to let him die. Let him die? You said you tried to save him! A lie. Because you couldn't and still can't face the truth. Father had doomed the Lin Kuei to mediocrity. Now, we will achieve greatness. <laughs> Knocking everyone out with the chain, bro. Well, that's more than just knocking out. Imagine getting beat up by a dude in chains. Mighty general of Outworld. Let's kick General Shao's of Bootay. Teleport. Hey. Get over here. I Come on, Chow. But you won't corrupt me. What do you mean Bihan was already corrupt, I'm telling you. Oh, I have a fire elemental. Oh, 
Ooh, dang. Oh, I'm alive still. Ho ho ho. Neither of you are up to the task. Do not let Kwai Liang escape. Burning them statues, bro. Hey, Rain. So you've declined Shang Tsung's offer. I assume your brother has not. The sorcerer tempted him into forsaking his oath. He can be convincing, can't he? Spurning yeah. him is a grave mistake. Fight. Ow. Frankly, that's insulting. Hey, yeah. The mistake is yours, Outworlder. What have you done? Havoc. I'm guessing this is how he get his face busted up. Hey, Darius. Another one, so soon. Easy. That should be his whole face, not just the bottom. Motherfucker. Oh, 
Okay. Go, Bort. Out of here, Darius. Havoc's design is okay in this game. I'm so sure you had like a helmet or something. Yikes. I'm in enemy havoc. That's disgusting. I said stop. Fire. I miss. Fire. There we go. A Lin Kuei's flame is not easily smothered. Split up. We must find him. Where the hell is smoke at? What happened? Where's Bihan? He's betrayed us. We're all in imminent danger. Letting father die. Forsaking Earthrealm. He's abandoned all reason. I knew Bihan's frustrations ran deep, but I never thought they could inspire such madness. We can't let his corruption spread. Whatever it takes, I am with you. Thank you. We may not share blood, but we are brothers. Ooh. Do your oaths mean nothing? It's your duty to obey my will. Not when it betrays Ling Fei principles. We won't sacrifice them to serve your ambition. Hi, subby boy. What a movie fight. Ah, uh, there's the scar. The Sub Zero this scar. Brother, embrace the future. I want no part of it. You pervert all that it means to be Lin Kuei. Fight. The scar doesn't appear. In, you know, in, in other parts of the game, maybe you know it heals a little bit and it's less noticeable. I wonder how Kui Liang got the scar in previous timelines. Fire. Damn it. You disgrace our family and clan. That he does. One more fire. Thanks, Bobby. Well, see into that. You are my grandmaster no longer. What are you doing? Once he's exposed, won't you be made grandmaster? 
You forget Cyrax and Sector. Their loyalty to Bihan is absolute. They'll sooner abet his corruption than follow me. We must chart a new course. One that both honors our father's legacy and serves Earthrealm. Help me. We can't leave him here to aid Shang Tsung. are you seeing this? That's supposed to be an... Oh, whoa. You arrived oh. on a moment too soon, Gears. What have you learned? In scrutinizing Shang Tsung's first meeting with his benefactor, I made an important discovery. Her life essence, the very time crystals that make up her being, are not of this timeline. Not of this timeline? How could someone from a previous timeline enter this one? That cannot happen. If that cannot happen, then what has happened, Gears? There are no other timelines than those that have come before. The parallel All one with Shang Tsung. This points to the presence of a second timeline, which exists concurrently with ours. Two timelines, side by side, moving forward simultaneously? Never in a billion lifetimes have I seen this. But that does not make the other timeline any less real. There can be no doubt that Shang Tsung's benefactor hails from it. Hmm. And who she is, why she's here, where she's from. All questions we need answered, which we can't, for we are under attack. I will go to Sindel, convince her to withdraw from Earthrealm by showing her how history is being manipulated. That will require revealing to her your prior role as Keeper of Time. The situation gives me no choice. I will need your help, Gears, to prove my claims to the Empress. Gears Chapter? Oh, we made Chapter. Well. Well, we'll be playing through Lee May chapter a little later. Thanks for joining me on another one. So I, I see there are so many fights in chapter 15. I ought to split that into two or three parts. There are, what, 13 fights in chapter 15? I'll check later and I'll determine how long we make these things. We'll see ya. See ya. See ya.